It's quick and easy to make digital portfolios in Brightwheel using the observations you've already recorded. Portfolios can be digitally shared or printed to share with families at conferences. Portfolios make learning visible. They provide a record of individual child growth and development, and digital portfolios can include observations, assessments, photos, videos, and work samples. You can create portfolio templates to save time and make it even easier to keep all the portfolios consistent across your center. To share with families at conferences, we suggest combining a printed copy of the portfolio with individual child assessment forms, if desired, and a few work samples. You can also share the digital portfolio with families through Brightwheel before or after conferences. Each program will develop their own system for portfolios and sharing with families. Let's create a portfolio. First, log into Brightwheel on the web, then click on Learning on the purple sidebar menu. Then jump to Portfolios and click on the Create New drop-down menu and choose Portfolio. You can either start from a template or start from scratch. For this example, we're going to start with a preschool template that I've already created. Then select the student you want to create a portfolio for, either using the filters or from the list below. Next, add a date range for your portfolio. By adding a start date and an end date, it will filter the activities in the panel on the right. Then fill out the optional descriptions for each section and add photos, videos, observations, and notes previously logged for the student from the right sidebar. Hover over any of the logged activities to add them to a section. Let's add this one to social emotional. And there it is. You can click on preview to see the guardian view and then go back to editing by returning to Builder. You can continue to work on portfolios over time by going to Portfolios and choosing the portfolio you would like to edit. When you're ready to share the portfolio with families, click Publish. And then families will see their child's portfolio in their feed. You can also print a printer-friendly version here. Creating templates can help speed up the process of building portfolios and ensure consistency across your program. All staff can easily access and use templates created when starting a new portfolio. First, log in on the web. Click on the Learning tab and then Portfolios. Select Create New Template. Name your template and then add a date range if desired. Then begin adding sections by labeling each section. We'll give you some ideas on formatting your templates on the next slide. Save your template, and then it will be available for your teachers to use under Templates. Or Create New Portfolio, start from a template, and there's your template. Choose the child. And there you go. We have five portfolio template ideas to get you started. Keep it simple and highlight the positives in areas of growth with glows and grows. Or share how the student does with their daily routine at the program with the daily routines checklist in areas to work on. Suggestion number three, focuses on the child's strengths, what we will work on in the classroom, and what parents can encourage their child to do at home. Number four is similar, I am great at, I need help with, and things to practice at home. Or organize the portfolio sections by developmental domain.